Sonic Ranch, in the border town of Tornillo, Texas, is the world's largest residential recording studio complex. There are five world-class studios designed by Vincent van Hoff on a 1,700-acre pecan orchard which borders the Rio Grande and Mexico. Located 30 miles 48 kilometers east of El Paso, Texas, in the border town of Tornillo, there are five houses on the property where artists stay while recording. The studio was founded in 1989 by the current owner, director Tony Rancich around a large traditional Spanish hacienda, which is an adobe structure that was built in the late 1930s, with pine tree vigas as the ceiling structure. Some rock bands have noted the calm, rural wilderness and easy access to Ciudad Juarez across the border. Topic. Studio complex The Neve Control Room designed by Vincent van Hoff features an 80-channel vintage Neve 8078 console with 31,105 mic pre-EQs. The left side of this console was the original West Coast Motown board which was used to record many Motown artists, including Diana Ross, The Temptations, Gladys Knight, Bubba Knight, G.C. Cameron, James Jamerson, Marvin Gaye, and The Jackson 5. Madonna purchased the console and had it in her studio Brooklyn in Hollywood in the early 1990s, where Yoshiki Hayashi purchased and put it together with another 8078 into its present form by Pat Schneider and Wes's Dolly. Sonic Ranch acquired this console in 2006. The big tracking room that is connected to this control room is 36 by 47 feet 11.0 meters times 14.3 meters and has 22 foot high 6.7 meters ceilings. There are two isolation booths in the big tracking room and two isolation booths in the large 36 by 31 foot 11.0 meters times 9.4 meters control room. The A Studio, which was the first studio to be established at Sonic Ranch, is partially subterranean and features a 40-channel E GSSL console with vintage Neve outboard mic pre EQs and has four tracking rooms with differing acoustics and dimensions. The stone room is a five-sided room made of travertine stone, with a slanted latia ceiling which optimizes acoustic diffusion. When stripped of baffles and carpets, it serves as an echo chamber during mixdown. The center tracking room, leading to the drum room, has carpets and absorbable material between the traditional vigas in the ceiling structure which shortens the decay time in the room and makes it suitable for vocals and electric guitar tracking. The drum room has a wood floor, a slanted wood ceiling and wooden doors which can be opened or closed to adjust the ambiance of the room. The top room, which descends into the control room, contains a 6 feet 11 in 2.11 meters 1978 K Kawai piano and a 1961 Hammond B3 with Leslie. The Adobe Studio was designed by Vincent van Hoff within a hundred-year-old Adobe structure with a vaulted wooden ceiling. It contains a vintage Neve 8088 console with Class A 31102 mic pre EQs, which were designed by Rupert Neve in 1977. The Adobe tracking room is 30 times 28 times 16 feet, 9.1 times 8.5 times 4.9 meters, and has geometric ceiling panels, corner and half rounds, and massive ceiling trusses to enhance acoustic diffusion. This studio is on a property that contained one of the original custom house 
crossing points from Mexico into the United States. The mix room was designed by Vincent van Hoff and is in the left wing of the original Spanish hacienda. It is 20 feet 6 meters wide and 40 feet 12 meters deep and contains a 64-channel SSLG, G Plus console. It resides next to the swimming pool in the Hacienda patio. The mastering room is in the center section of the Spanish Hacienda and is 18 feet 5.5 meters wide and 27 feet 8.2 meters deep. It features a Rupert Neve designed masterpiece. The mastering room has wooden panels and colorful fabrics from Brussels and Paris woven into its acoustical design. This room contains two of the 30 original Salvador Dali lithographs which, along with artwork by Pablo Picasso, Henri Matisse, Joan Miro and Marc Chagall, are dispersed throughout the complex in an art reflects and inspires art motif. Topic. Equipment Sonic Ranch has a collection of over 55 vintage and modern guitars, 50 vintage and mod amps, 4 modern and 3 vintage drum kits, 54 guitar pedals, 1927 Steinway and 1978 K. Kawai Grand Pianos, and a 1961 B3 organ with 147 Leslie. The Mike collection includes three Newman U47 long body chrome tops, two Newman M249s, two Newman KM53s and 54s, two Stephen Paul audio modified Newman U67s, two Newman M269s which are the European version of U67s, three Newman U87s, three Telefunken Elam 251s, two Telefunken Elam 250s, two AKGC 12s, and two Coles 4038s. Topic. List of artists recorded Following is a list of some of the artists who have recorded songs at Sonic Ranch Enrique Bunbury Alex Campos Sue Presencia Miguel Balboa Arian LVX Ville Touchwood a Silent Film Akron Family Anika Animal Collective Ballyhoo Band of Horses Benny Ibarra Beach House Billy Gibbons Blacklight District Bronco Bullet for My Valentine the Burning of Rome The Black Angels The Blackout Brand New Cannibal Corpse The Chamanas Craig Conley Cloud Nothings Cody Jinx and the Tone Deaf Hippies Connor Auburst and the Mystic Valley Band The Devil Makes Three El Mato Un Policia Motorizado Greg Rowley Gunger Taking Back Sunday Ya yeah, Ya yeah, Yaz Enrique Bunbury Gogol Bordello Utopians Johnny Rawls Smith Westerns Sublime with Rome Mudvayne Ministry Nico Vega At the Drive-In The London James Vincent McMorrow And You Will Know Us by the Trail of Dead Hansen Hello Seahorse Holocausto Norteño 
Your Vegas Damage Plan Devil Driver Dead Sarah Old 97s Sparta Sleeper Car Snarky Puppy Tesla Into Cable ISAC Zoe Kalimba Euridia Ely Guerra Into the Presence Ivy Rise Jessica Hernandez Jumbo Jenny Lewis Octane OK OV7 Prong Plastilina Mosh Eric Rubin Moderato Motel Kids These Days Jello Biafra Girl in a Coma The Blackout Camera Can't Lie This World Fair Nevermore Shearwater The Mountain Goats Elefante Flogging Molly Freaky Kids in Glass Houses Jesus Adrian Romero Lennon Murphy McFly Mercy Me Me Talk Pretty Natalia Lafourcade David Garza Deep Blue Something Del Sol Rorschach Test Flotsam and Jetsam N17 Rake Red Sun Rising Rebo Flavin Skin Lab Blue Condition Un Dia de Octubre Explosions in the Sky The New Master Sounds The Main The Madden Brothers Pacifier Portugal The Man Prehab Purple The Dirty Heads Rumatera Dirty Karma Injamber Sig Raga Swans Oscar Soleil Radius Otis Clay Barbara Carr Starbomb Topic. List of producers, engineers Following is a list of some of the producers and or engineers who have recorded and or mixed songs at Sonic Ranch. <laughs>